Well, the key to losing weight and feeling great isn't just about what you eat. It's also about what you drink. I know I'm about to make a lot of people sad when you hear this. It's at the grocery store. Hidden dangers can be found everywhere on the drink aisle in the form of what else but high fructose corn syrup. Water. It is everywhere, making up 70% of the earth. Apart from oxygen, there is nothing your body needs more for survival than water. What we have to remember is that your body needs to clean itself. When you wash your clothes, you don't wash them in coat. You wash them in water, because water is a solvent. It takes out some of the things that you don't want in it. Same with the body. You need water to clean the body. Water regulates all functions in your body, and that includes your metabolism. And if that's not enough to convince you to drink more water, maybe this will. It helps your body metabolize stored fat. But despite all these benefits, many of us still turn to other liquids trying to quench our thirst, like bottled green tea. The worst part about this is people think green tea has got to be healthy for them. Because green teas, you know, it does have some really powerful antioxidants, which is great. But when you start throwing in other substances into the mix, it's not so good in there. Lifetime fitness trainer Edgar Curtis and nutrition coach Jesse McCollum both say beware, even on items you think are healthy. Awesome. We've got tea, water, and high fructose corn syrup. And if you reach for the diet version, Edgar and Jesse say despite the 100% natural claim, it's really no better for your body. It don't have high fructose. Instead, it's been replaced with at least two artificial sweeteners. Artificial sweeteners, studies say, artificially raise your sugar levels, making you crave more sweets in the end. So you think that you're satisfying the, the centers of your brain that are asking you for that sweet taste, but you're not. Instead of satisfying them, you're firing them up. So you want, just want more of it. If true, that will make it difficult to slenderize when drinking this fused tropical fruit punch. Same story, Edgar says, with any other diet drinks, from diet lemonade to low sugar or no sugar juice to Coke Zero. Just when you may think Gatorade is a great thirst quencher when you're working out, this fitness duo says, think again. So we got no fruit juice, water, sucrose syrup, high fructose corn syrup. See, can you imagine that? You've got a sports drink, that, and they didn't use to make it this way. They didn't use to come with high fructose corn syrup. It's changed. Syrup, Jesse says, basically turning straight into fat. As for this stuff. Basically, sugar in a bottle. Yeah, sugar with color and preservative. And not even good sugar, bad sugar. To really understand just how much drinks packed with sugar can add to your waistline, Jesse says, think about this. The 